Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the coding with T. Today we are going to create our second flutter tutorial for section 2 for our flutter basic crash course. As you can see we are in section 2 and we are about to create our second video of this section. In this video we are going to learn how to add images in flutter. As we all know that basically we have two main methods to add image or the two main sources to add image. The first one is the asset image, the local image from our systems and then we have the images from the internet files from the internet so we add them using URL and I'm going to talk about both assets as well as network images so let's get started open Android studio okay let's quickly have a recap of our section 1 in very few seconds so first we learn how to install the flutter on Android studio after installation we learn how to create the flutter application and we learn what is this main function how to use this run app and these fat arrows then we learn very useful and the basic core widgets of the flutter like material app and we divided our code for the whole application in main dot dot and then screen wise in like you can see a dashboard dot dot and we put scaffold and all that content app bar text center specifically in our dashboard screen so we also learn how to add logic in our code so for this tutorial let me just delete the previous code Okay, inside the scaffold, I'm in the body, I'm going to add an image. So we have two main sources of image. The one is the asset image and the second one is the network image. And we again have two methods to add images from these both sources. So let's first talk about the first one, which is simply adding a widget, the image widget. And by hovering over this, you can see we can add an image object which is the image provider we can add width height color which is the background color box fit alignment no repeat and a few other options so let's add image here in here we can pass both asset image and network image this is the asset image and let me show you the network image this is the network image so we in both asset image and in network image we just have to pass, pass the URL so in the asset image we need to add the image from this application so first we have to add an image or the file inside our application so head towards the root folder right click on it go to new and create a directory remember that I'm adding it inside the root folder not inside the lib folder and I'm going to name it images okay now to add that image in here I have an image, I am going to copy this add toward the Android Studio and I am going to paste it inside the images click OK to add and the image has been added double click on it and its image is here now the image has been added inside our project but it's not declared inside the code to use it in our project so head towards this pubspec.yml file and in here we have to search for assets these are commented we have to uncomment it okay uh, you just have to remember while adding the assets that assets should be having two spaces right after this flutter you can see flutter is having no space this is called identation and right below the flutter we have one and two spaces for the assets and same for the images one and two then we have the minus sign or the dash and then we have one space here and then the path of our image so in my case we have images let me change the name here once added click on this pub.get once it's finished go to dart analysis and you can see we don't have any error or the warning sign that image is not found if you see any message here which is saying that images uh, Im there is no such image found for example I'm going to add a name which is which we don't have any image and you can see with the asset image coding with the does not exist so make sure that you have the right name entered for your image and also there must not be any backspace here it should start with the images images folder should inside this root folder so now I am going to copy this one add back to the dashboard and in here I am going to paste my image and at the top you can see our pubspec.yml file has been changed so to get the latest dependencies click on it and it has been loaded let's run the application to see our image and you can see we have our image displayed here 
so there is one more method to use the image so first let me use the network image now inside I have to pass the URL instead of the local URL I just got this URL from the internet save our application okay now our code has been aligned now inside this image let me add a width property for example we want to make a specific width we can add a width like this we have a height property we can give it in doubles we can also add a fit property we can use this fit property with the box fit dot we have a few options we have cover fill fill height sorry fit height contain so let's try contain here and you can see the image has been changed now let's try a cover and you can see by this way we can change the values of the images of our screens we can use these properties for network image for the asset image and we have one more way to add the image which is image dot asset and in here we don't have to declare anything but we directly declare the path of the image as you can see we we said go to the image and call the asset so instead of this asset same way we can call the network as well so this is a quick and the short way to add images and in here let's pass the asset run the application and you can see our image has been loaded and by same things we can paste here as well like height pass the height 300 we can also use fit make it box fit dot dot contain run the application okay in here you can see we have a very simple and a very clear problem that using this image dot asset over over this and you can see we we cannot add shadow to our image we cannot change the shape of this image so how we can change the shape or the shadow of the image in this tutorial basically what we learned is how we can add image in our flutter application so we also try to learn that how we can simply design the image as well by using height width fit alignment direction as well in our next video using container we are going to add shadow to the image we are going to add shape to the image it will be circle it will be rectangle and we will try to make our image more beautiful or we can try to create our profile image like with the shadow with the circle around it with the radius border etc using a container and we will also learn more features about the container in the next video as container is a very useful widget in our flutter app development so i hope you learn something new if you learn something please like the video and if you are new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe it Again, thank you for watching. Take care. Allah Hafiz.